Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. If you are a new viewer, welcome. I hope you stick around. So today I'm giving myself a little bit of a challenge for my daily spreads. You notice I say spreads. I only have the Empowering, Empowering Women Value Pack sticker book and then <clears throat> the sticker pack, which mainly just has like decorative stickers. So it's no real functional. I am going to be doing um, Monday the 23rd, August 23rd, and Tuesday, August 24th using one sticker book. And I want both spreads to be somewhat different. I also don't have a lot of stickers in this sticker book. You see, I've used up a lot. <laughs> so that's where the challenge comes in. So if you want to see what I create, stick around. All right, let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to go to my daily and let's see, like I said, we're doing the 23rd Monday and then the 24th Tuesday. So I'm just going to pull that out of the planner and let's go ahead and white out the headers. And I'm going to go ahead and white out Tuesday as well. I'm not really sure what to expect with this. Um, I was kind of almost wondering, like I was flipping through the book and I was kind of almost wondering if it would be better to save this for maybe the weekend. But um, yeah, I, sorry, I just want to readjust. There we go. I decided Monday and Tuesday. So to start out with, um, I might use the sticker pack, not positive yet. I'm going to start out with the corners and I think I'm just going to go ahead now and choose both stickers for it. And I have a lot, I do have a few, quite a few of the, the clear backed. So one of them. I'm gonna use this, you get in life what you have the courage to ask for. And that's gonna kind of, um, to help me decide like what color that I'm using. And then I think, I kind of like this one right here. It says, you are powerful, beautiful, brilliant, and brave. And then I'm also going to go ahead and put some quotes at the bottom because that's what I like to do. So this is back to Monday and there's a quote for the bottom. Now I want to, to kind of decide. Okay, so we have this goals for the week. So I'm going to use that maybe like right here and I might use like a sticker behind it. So I'm not going to put that fully down just yet and here this would be super cute behind it I'm kind of thinking that I'm going to maybe put it just like that so then that way a lot of that green is popping out okay all right we're so far so good so this book, I want to say that this book either released late 2018 or early 2019. Um, it was one of like my very first sticker books and I absolutely love it, but I will admit I don't use it a lot. I'm going to use one of these green um, to-do stickers. Because then what I was thinking of doing, get past all of those, I was thinking about either taking it for this black one, or let's bring in some more of this yellow. So these stickers right here, they all said hanging out. I whited that out because the chance of me using it for that purpose is kind of slim to none. 
So I'm just gonna go ahead and put this to do right on top of it. And I am gonna go ahead and use the sticker pack because I want some of the flowers from it. Um, let's see. I'm kind of thinking, I don't wanna, I wanna bring in another color. I don't wanna do a yellow or a teal sticker. So what I may do is take this big pink flower, I'm going to cut it in half. Half of it is gonna go right here. And then the other half of it is gonna go right down here. Um, and I kind of put it on my hand to help remove some of the stickiness. So in this way, it can also slightly go behind the to-do. And I think instead of cutting it, I'm just going to cover it up with a sticker. So perfect, that, that looks really cute. That helps kind of bring in some colors and break up the monotony of the pink and the green, or the yellow and the green. And I know for a fact I'm not gonna find checklists in here. So I'm gonna use the sticker. Even though it says meat for coffee, I'm gonna cut that off. And this is just basically gonna be my coffee sticker. Um, I'm removing all of the priorities, except for one. That looks actually kind of cute. What I am going to do, since I know for a fact I don't have checklists and I'm not going to, most likely not going to find some bullets or some dots, um, I'm going to use one of my acrylographs and let's just go ahead and continue with the yellow. So I'm going to use yellow for this one. And I think I'm going to put this sticker this is this so it's kind of like my to do because I don't think I'm going to be able to find I don't think I'm going to be able to find an actual header I could use those I don't really like those though all right so let's use that so as you see I don't have a lot of, I, mean, I do have a lot of stickers but I also don't have a lot of stickers so I also kind of want something for down here. And I was honestly just thinking of another quote. So let's go actually to this one. I could always just do this. This one that says you are capable of amazing things. And then, just because I love the stickers, I want to actually incorporate a yellow over here. So, yellow sticker, cut in half. There we go. And then... Maybe just kind of put it right there. Sure, that looks good. All right, and then let's go ahead and add in my dots. So these are the Archer and Olive acrylographs. Um, I'm using the three millimeter, but right now they're only selling the 0.7 millimeter. So it, they are selling the ones that have a smaller tip. These are basically an acrylic paint pen um, what's really nice about these is that they do not bleed through the, the Happy Planner paper. So yeah, that's really nice and they have gorgeous colors. And like I said, it doesn't bleed through, doesn't ghost. It's fantastic. So there we go. We have one spread done. Let's go ahead and do the second spread. And I think what I'm gonna do for this one is I'm gonna incorporate some pink in here. So 
Oh, I do have these dots, but those were almost too big. Um, kind of thinking, I really like this quote. It says, you can't always choose what happens to you, but you can always choose how you feel about it. And let's use this box right here. I kind of want this sticker that says, make it happen. I don't know how I'm going to use that, but we'll see. And I think I also... I kind of want to use this box, but I don't know how easy it'll be to cover up the weekend plans. So let's also use this pink one. And I'll use another one of these meat for coffees and I will cover, I'll cut off the bottom of it. Kind of similar to what I did on the other page. And I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I could use this one, this is on my desk, to be like, my to-do. So on my desk basically means my to-do items. I like this one too. And I'm gonna actually use this up here, so then that way I can use this black one next to it. And I can put this pink one down here. It's going to go like slightly underneath of that. And then that's just going to go right there. And then this quote is going to go right there. Okay, guys, I'm so sorry. I had technical difficulties. Okay, so the last thing that you saw, I was putting on this on my desk sticker. Um, basically, I decided to use that kind of as like my to-do checklist header. And then um, I decided to use this quote. It says, I like to make things happen. And if they don't happen, I like to make them happen. Or I like things to happen. And if they don't happen, I like to make them happen. And then I just, I used, decided to pick out two of the functional boxes. This one I actually whited out a lot because it used to be a hangout sticker. And then I put a quote in the bottom right hand corner. And then I have a meet for coffee with the priorities. So now what I need to do is I need to actually pick out a color for Ooh, this is where it's gonna get tough. I don't think I have a color I can use. Um, so it's gonna be color for my checklist. I do have like a, a pink dusty rose. I think what I'm actually gonna use for this instead, I'm not gonna use my, um, my acrylic graphs. Instead, I'm gonna use a mild liner. Um, this is just like a pink mild liner. I think that it'll look good and I'm just going to do some circles. Yeah, there are a few colors that I don't have of the acrylographs and you know if I had all of the sets, I might have that color that I needed, but I don't. I'm not, you know, it's, I can't buy any more of the three millimeter sets. And I also can't justify buying another, or you know, buying the 7.7 millimeter mild liners just to get extra colors so I have to basically make do. I'm also going to go ahead and I've got this header right here. Um, I think this green one will match. I'm just going to put little header right there and I'm also going to use mm. the header for up here as well. So I, I think that looks cute. It's kind of a little similar, but different. So I think I like that. And I used more stickers from the Empowering Women book. So you never know, you might see me do a full week of these, of these spreads. All right, let's go ahead and get my planner. 
So we have Monday, August 23rd, and we have Tuesday, August 24th. I think it's cute. They're super functional. And yeah. So if you enjoyed this, um, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. If you, um, if you're not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. I really appreciate it. And yeah, have a good day. Bye. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe and enjoy the next video.